Let's take it over to pro trader Jane Galena for the final trade of the day. Hello to you, Jane. As a pro, you know there are times to get into the market and there are times to sit on the sidelines with cash in hand. What is your plan? Hello, Angela. Well, it feels like the market is trying to decide if it's consolidating and gonna go higher or this is a top in which we're going to see further downward movement in the market overall. I will never forget three years ago on Thursday after President's Day, I was heading out for spring break. And when I landed in the Dominican Republic, I'm so happy I had puts because that was the downward turn of the market from the dark pool selling at the top. So right now I am looking to hold cash as I'm not sure that this is a consolidation for a pop higher as we are starting to pull down. I'm really watching the 412.50 level on the SPY and in particular two bigger names this week that had dark pool prints that could definitely influence the market. That's gonna be Amazon and Apple. Both of them hold a larger percentage in the SPY ETF and QQQ NASDAQ ETF. So looking for Apple to break above 150 and close above 150. Then I'm gonna put my bull hat on for Apple. Until then, I'm sitting on the sidelines for a discounted price. And same is true with Amazon. Looking at Amazon to see, hey, are we going to break 96.50 strong, even 100? 100, I would feel confident. This is gonna be moving higher to new highs for the year. However, at this time, watching both for those nice discounted prices. Always good to have a strategy. Thank you so much, Jane. Thank you, Angela. It's always a pleasure. Go to businessfirstam.com for where to see our show on TV.